if x equal to 11, find x power 5 minus 12x power 4 plus 12x cube minus 12x square plus 12x minus 1. This is a very simple question. Only thing you have to understand the root cause of a problem. Options are 5, 9, 10, 0. 5, 9, 10, 0. Those of you who want to know the source of the question, this question is picked out from SSC CHSL. SSC CHSL. Original previous year question picked out from SSC CHSL. If x equal to 11, find x power 5 minus 12x power 4 plus 12x cube minus 12x square plus 12x minus 1. Now if you see here, what is the textbook method? Textbook method. Most of the students who will solve this method and from this method they derived some useless conclusions you don't require just by looking at a question after few minutes you'll understand how to solve the question in seconds what they will do is first read the question okay x is given as value 11 okay find x power 5 minus 12x power 4 plus 12x cube minus 12x square plus 12x. What is given in the question? x equal to 11. What are the coefficients? It is 12. Here the input is 11 and here he is asking x power 5 minus 12x power 4 something. So what I will do is x power 5 wherever 12 is there I will do it as 11 plus 1 which is x plus 1 into x power 4 plus wherever 12 is there I will write it as 11 plus 1. Wherever 12 is there, I will write it as 11 plus 1. Wherever 12 is there, I will write it as x plus 1 into x minus 1. Where x plus 1 is 11 plus 1, it is 12. 11 plus 1, it is 12. People are not identifying the root cause of a problem, solving it directly. So this will become x power 5 minus x power 5 minus x power 4 plus x power 4 x cube minus x cube minus x square plus x square so x minus 1 x minus 1 11 minus 1 it is 10 11 minus 1 it is 10 this is one way to solve the problem wherever 12 is there write it down as 11 plus 1 this is a traditional method this is a traditional method now if this question is given to me how i will solve this question how I will solve the question? My way of solving is very logical, very conceptual, non formula way of solving, very simple way to understand. If this question is given to me, how I will solve the question? How I will solve the question? If x equal to 11, x power 5 minus 12x power 4 plus 12x cube minus 12x square plus 12x. All these terms all these terms contain x all these terms contain x what is x value 11 that means from here to here every term is multiplied by x that means every term is multiplied by 11 that means from here to here every term contain x that means it is divisible by 11 so 11 into something what is remaining minus 1 so answer when divided by 11 it should give reminder minus 1 right 5 not possible 9 not possible 0 0 means it is perfectly divisible by 11 perfectly divisible by 11 are you all with me so then 10, 11, 1s are 11, negative reminder minus 1, negative reminder minus 1. A simple observation in this question, from here to here it is divisible by x, x power 5 is divisible by x, 12x power 4 divisible by x, 12x cube divisible by x, minus 12x square divisible by x, plus 12 it is divisible by x. Are you all with me? Are you all with me? Suppose if there is a smart student, he might ask me a question. Sir, what if it is? If there is one more option, 21. If you are getting this doubt, probably with 15 years experience, I might have probably 
created a lot of questions which confuse the students. Sir, what if there is an another option 21? 11 into 1 minus 1. 11 into 2 minus 1. There could be two choices that can be possible. Definitely right. Right logic. This is one way to look at it. And another way to look at it. These are all very, very easy questions, sir. Another way to look at it is, see here. Listen carefully. Again, read the question. I told you three rules. Read the question. Identify the root cause of a problem. Simplify the problem. Don't complicate the problem. Read the question. X power 5 minus 12x power 4 plus 12x cube minus 12x square plus 12x. Again, read the question. Here it contains 12. Here it contains 12. Here it contains 12. Here it contains 12. What is remaining? x power 5 minus 1. What is x? x is 11 power 5 minus 1. We will divide it by 12. Check what is the remainder. 12 ones are 12 minus 1. Minus 1 power odd minus 1. Minus 1 minus 1 minus 2. That means answer when divided by 12. It should 12. It should give remind, negative reminder. Minus 2 or positive reminder. 10. 21. 12 twos are 24. 24 minus 2 I am getting. Minus 2 I am getting. Because the coefficients 12, 12, 12, 12. Simple observation. First 5 terms it is divisible by x. So answer should be divisible by 11. Reminder minus 1. I eliminated the options which are not of the form. 11 into something minus 1. Suppose if there is more than one answer option. Check all the other coefficients are divisible by 12. So, second, third, fourth, fifth, it is divisible by 12. Check what is the reminder when first and last are divisible by 12. X divided by 12. 11 divided by 12. 12 ones are 12. Negative reminder minus 1. Minus 1 power odd is minus 1. Minus 1 minus 1, it is minus 2. Negative reminder minus 2. Positive reminder 10. These questions, without using mathematics, hardly 5 seconds to take it. Traditional method, this is a traditional method. I am not interested in this kind of right method. Anyway, examiner also, he is asked, he is giving that question to check whether you can use a very logical way and get the answer very fast. I hope the student who asked a doubt, it is clear.